Good morning. Good morning. Are you feeling better today? Yes, I'm much better. Yesterday was horrible. I think it was a new record for you. Yeah, I didn't eat. That was a new record for me all day. And I was just lying in the bed all day. So that was fun. <laughs> <laughs> but today is going to be a better day. It's going to be a awesome day, I think. We are going to do some shopping because we have a toothpaste. We haven't got any more shampoo left and we need uh, more food. This is really what I call a man's job, you know? But it's starting to get empty, so then we have a problem. Then we have to go in the forest and find some more. Mission completed. the new wipes I think they are a little bit dry I like quick solution when it comes to cleaning but uh, therefore I also bought this one to make it wetter no. <laughs> triple action so you can use it for everything everything here I found carrot from two weeks ago or from Yesterday. No. Did we eat carrot yesterday? Yes. This is not from yesterday for sure. Can you throw this beautiful plant? <laughs> oh. This was basil. Here it goes. It looks so much better when I on a clean kitchen. Benny Benny. She will come in my hand. Are you dirty? No, not really. No problem. I don't need to go to the gym today. Just the vacuuming and the cleaning will keep me in shape. Nom, 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 nom. Are you eating? You uh, said you were starving. Det 
and we're on the air direct from Lie. No way. <laughs> Question round. What do you call it in uh, the short? Q and A. Q and A. Okay. Are you ready? Okay. If you could choose your age forever, what age would you choose and why? I think I would choose somewhere between twenty eight and 30. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was uh, forever 21 now. No, because, yeah, <laughs> because, <laughs> because uh, when you're 21, you are not so developed <laughs> yet in your head. I mean, your body looks great, but I don't know. The head is not following. So uh, when I think about what I learned before, I was like, yeah, before I was 26, I was just stupid and lived the life to the fullest and didn't think about consequences and stuff like that. So I think also 27, 28, uh, 28 is a good time to have kids and start a family. And you're also older, smarter and yeah, more attractive in a way, I would say. In every way. I in every say. way. <laughs> okay, would you go shark diving? Bungee jumping or skydiving? Skydiving. <laughs> you look like... For sure. Uh, you know I hate sharks. That's my worst fear in the world. I think you uh, booked a trip for it. <laughs> no. I was thinking about it. Uh, I'm afraid of everything that can eat me. That's a rule. So everything that can eat me, I, I, I stay away from. <laughs> okay. Uh, it's one of the weirdest things you used to do as a teenager. Oh my god, weirdest things. Yes. Yeah, I ate four cheeseburgers in the lunch break at school every day for three years. That's kind of weird. <laughs> yes. Well, it was You're it? looking at yes. my body. Where is your cheeseburgers? Yes. It uh, disappeared in the exercise. That's crazy. <laughs> Four cheeseburgers, cheeseburgers every day. From McDonald's. Yeah. Favorite place. Okay. Uh, what accomplishment are you most proud of? I think I'm proud of uh, the time when I realized my failure and had to face it because that was my biggest fear. I think I'm proud of uh, what I learned on the way and I'm very grateful. For all my mistakes. <laughs> What's your biggest mistake? Uh, that I thought I could do everything on my own. That I didn't depend on people. And that was a big mistake. <laughs> but you learn. You get older and wiser. So I'm proud of that I faced like my biggest fear. And yeah, that okay. chapter is closed. But I'm still proud. Okay, to jump. And uh, from one side to another, what's your most bizarre talent? Bizarre talent? Does yeah. it need to be like a great talent or? No, well, bizarre is like crazy, weird. Like this. <laughs> 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 that I can bend my fingers. And I can, can also make them like this. Kind of bizarre, right? <laughs> can I twist Wait. your foot over your head also? Yeah. Look, this is kind of weird. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if you can say a talent. Yeah. Yeah. You ask. Yeah. Yes. From talent to what drives you to drives you to what you do and what motivates you. I think uh, what drives me is to change what what I can see is not functional in a society and also to create something new to grow and to create yeah and uh, my motivation is what motivates me that's a hard one because it depends on the subject it's yeah. just uh, when it comes to like accomplishments or because uh, m motivation can be everything from what I do in the exercise or what I do in the home base or what I do okay. work wise. What's so it's a, like a what motivates you to stand up in the morning then to make it to so change the world. <laughs> <laughs> easy peasy. Easy peasy. Oh my god. 
What, what did you and love? And to make people think. Yeah. Think on their own. That's Use important. their brain. Yeah. Not be too affected by the society guidelines, the box lines. Okay. Mm. Well, what did you love uh, most about your place, uh, the place you grew up? And what did you love uh, the least? Actually, I love to grow up with animals. I know, yeah. It a has big a big animal level. Yeah, it has a big influence about the respect, <coughs> <laughs> the respect you have for everything, the living, in every way. And I feel like I'm closer to nature in a way, more balanced with the, uh, yeah. And also, I'm more down to earth because I grew up in a farm. I don't con uh, I don't find myself to material things, but I bind myself to the living things. And what I hate the most? Yes. Mm, that my parents were always working. Can I say that? Yes. Is that a okay answer? That's a good one. They were, yeah. Okay, what's the thing you're most scared of? What scares you? Like physical or mental? <laughs> you can choose. It's up to you. What scares you? I can take one physical and one mental. Just take the thing that scares uh, you the most. To, uh, to lose somebody I love. That scares the shit out of me. <laughs> and physical, it's uh, sharks. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Let's end this with a good one. If you had three wishes, what what would they be? God. That's a good. That's a end. thinking one again. Yes. I will change the world in a way that's beneficial for everybody, not only for the one little percent of the rich people. And I wish that uh, everybody had the same opportunity to choose their life the way they want it and not just be born into something. Is that two or one? <laughs> That's two. Yeah. So yeah, one more. That's my kids. Bum, badam, bum, badam, bum, badam, bum. Yeah. Uh, that my kids uh, will succeed and find their path through life and love what they do. Okay. I have to Good. take one more. What was, uh, who was your favorite Spice Girl? Edith. So I don't remember. Maybe the sporty one? She was a little bit ugly, you know? She was an outstander. I love outstanding people. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, yeah, she was sporty and I liked activities. So, good answer. Yes. <laughs> I do like my hat. <laughs> Mr. Maria Bade. Shall we say good night? Yeah, we do that and we take you tomorrow. Okay. We do you tomorrow. <laughs> Okay. See you tomorrow. Bye. Good night.